Hey, my Spruance kids, my second to third graders. Okay, so I will be reading to you a book called King and Kayla and the Case of the Secret Code. So I'm just going to go ahead and minimize my screen. There we go. And then also screen share with you as well. Okay, so King and Kayla and the Case of the Secret Code. Hello, my name is King. I'm a dog. This is Kayla. She's my human. I'm trying to teach Kayla a new trick. It's called the Get King Some Cheese trick. I love cheese. It's my favorite food. I know a bunch of you guys loved the cheese sticks when we would get it for snack. Even I would have some of the cheese sticks. Here's how the trick works. I go to the refrigerator. I sit. I say, please get me some cheese. Kayla is having a hard time learning this trick. I say it louder. Please get me some cheese. Don't bark, King, Kayla says. I'm not barking. I'm just trying to teach Kayla a new trick. But she doesn't understand. So does any of you guys have any pets? Any dogs or cats or fish? What other kind of pets are there? Um, hamsters? Any? Anyone? Go ahead and leave a comment and answer my question. Because I would love to hear from you. I miss you guys very much. Okay, next page. I try singing. Let's go to the refrigerator. Let's get King some cheese. I dance around the kitchen. Ooh, I get it, Kayla says. You want to go outside. No, I don't want to go outside, I say. Why do humans always think dogs want to go outside? Ding dong. Someone's here. Someone's here, I say. Kayla and I race to the door. Who's there, Kayla asks. She peeks out the window. Then she opens the door. I crowd in beside her to see who it is. My tail droops. Who do you think is outside the door? No one. No one is there. They just rung the doorbell and look. Oh my goodness. They left a note right here. A little letter. Chapter 2. The letter. There's a letter on the outdoor mat. I pick it up and give it to Kayla. Thank you, King, she says with a smile. We go back inside. Kayla opens the letter. Her smile disappears. I can't read this, she says. Why do you think Kayla can't read the letter? There aren't any vowels in most of the words, Kayla says. You can't make words without vowels. I don't know what vowels are. And these are the only words I know how to read. Kayla, King, Beth, Pound. None of these words are in Kayla's letter. Do you guys know what vowels are? Go ahead and comment in the comment section below. But vowels are A, E, I, O, and U. Who would leave a strange letter on our doormat? Kayla asks. Sniff, sniff. The paper smells like oatmeal. I love oatmeal. It's my favorite food. Do you guys like oatmeal? Because I'm not the biggest fan of oatmeal. It's, it's okay. I used to not like it as much when I was younger because I didn't like the texture, but I like the cinnamon, the, the cinnamon maple syrup or maple oatmeal. It also smells like Kayla's friend Jillian. Did Jillian have left it? Ding dong. Someone's here. Someone's here, I say. Kayla and I race to the door. Is it Jillian? Who do you think is at the door now? Kayla peeks out the window. Then she opens the door. It's not Jillian. It's Mason. I love Mason. He's my favorite boy. I hop up and kiss him all over. No king, Kayla says. Oops, I forgot Kayla doesn't like it when I kiss other humans. 
Someone rang my doorbell and ran away, Mason tells Kayla. Was it you? No, she says. Someone rang my doorbell and ran away, too. They left a letter, but I can't read it. I got a letter, too. Mason says, I can't read my letter, either. Kayla and Mason put their letters side by side. So, I want you guys to take a look at both of these letters. Do you guys see any similarities, any differences about these letters? Make sure to comment in the comment description. They're almost exactly the same, Kayla says. The second word is the only one that's different. That doesn't help, Mason says. We don't know what any of the words say. Chapter 3, Making Lists who would leave us letters that we can't read, Mason asks. Sniff, sniff. Mason's letter smells like Jillian, too. I think Jillian left the letters, I say, but Kayla and Mason don't understand me. It must be someone we both know, Kayla says. Jillian, I say again. Kayla looks at me. Do you need to go outside, King? No, I say, I'm trying to tell you who left the letters. Why would someone leave us letters that we can't read, Mason asks. Maybe it's a game, Kayla says. Maybe it's supposed to be fun, like solving a mystery. It's a mystery, all right, Mason says, but I don't know how to solve a mystery. I do, Kayla says. She grabs a notebook and pencil. Let's make a list of everything we know about this case, she says. The same person left both letters. It's someone we both know. The two letters are the same, except for the second word. If I could write, I would add this to Kayla's list of things we know. Jillian left the letters. Now let's make a list of what we don't know about this case. So, what would you guys put on the list of what we don't know? Who sent the letters? What do the letters say? How do we figure out what the letters say? If I could write, I would add this to Kayla's list of things we don't know. Why did Jillian leave the letters and run away? Now we need a plan, Kayla says. I have a plan. Find Jillian. Chapter 4. King's Plan. I like to ru I run to the door. I need to go outside. I need to go outside, I shout. I think King needs to go outside, Kayla tells Mason. Yes, yes, yes. I dance around to show her that I really do want to go outside this time. Kayla grabs my leash and snaps it to my collar. Then we all go outside. Sniff, sniff. I smell Jillian's scent. It's on our front porch. It's on our front steps. It's on our sidewalk. Kayla holds tight to my leash. Slow down, King, she says. But I can't slow down. I've got Jillian's scent. I follow Jillian's scent down the street. Kayla and Mason have to run to keep up. I follow Jillian's scent around the corner. King, Kayla yells, slow down. I mean it. She pulls on my leash, but I pull harder. I pull the leash right out of Kayla's hand. Come back here, King, Kayla screams. She stomps her foot. You are being a bad dog. I stop. I don't like it when Kayla says I'm a bad dog. Then I see Jillian. She's only 11 to 10 houses away. <laughs> 11 to 10. Unfortunately for King, does not he does not know how to count. I'm not a bad dog, I tell Kayla. I'm a good dog. You'll see. I'm going to help you solve this case. I run toward Jillian. Kayla sees Jillian too. Help Jillian, she screams. King is loose. Help me catch him. She turns. She runs toward me, I let her catch me. Guess what? She got another one of those letters in her hand. It looks just like the letters she left for Kayla and Mason. Whose name or what name uh, is on that letter that Jillian is holding? Do you guys see? What can you think of that's a fun fact about this name? Well, it is a continent, which is kind of cool. And Asia is also really big as well. 
I would say like roughly, I don't know which is bigger, the United States, America, or Asia, but they're they're roughly this like similar size. Chapter five, cracking the code. Kayla grabs my leash. Thanks, Jillian, she says. What's that in your hand? Mason asks Jillian. Jillian puts the letter behind her back, but it's too late. Kayla and Mason have already seen it. It's a letter for Asia, Jillian says. I need to drop it off at her house. It looks like the letters we found on our front porches, Mason says. Did you leave letters on our porches? Kayla asks. Jillian blushes. Yes, she says. But we can't read them, Mason says. That's because they're written in code, Jillian says. You have to crack the code. How, Mason asks. I'll give you a hint, Jillian says. Z equals A. What kind of hint is that, Mason asks. Jillian just smiles and walks away. Okay, so now I want you to guys to go ahead. As you can see, they're on the pages. There are already Z's crossed out and turned to A's. I want you guys to figure out what these letters say. Given the hint that Z equals A, what do you guys think that means? That means that A would equal B, B equals C, and it would continue that same pattern for the rest of the alphabet. So I'm going to leave a couple minutes on the screen and i want you to comment below what the letter says by translating so you might want to grab a pencil and a piece of paper to write what the letters are to write the letters down and also translate it yourself so go ahead and do that and i'm going to wait for a couple of minutes We go back to our home. Kayla and Mason put the letters on the kitchen table. Let's change all the Z's in our letters to A's, Kayla says. That looks better, Mason says. Yes, because now we have more vowels, Kayla says. The words still don't look like real words, Mason says. If Z equals A, then maybe A equals B, Kayla says. And maybe B equals C. And C equals D, Mason says. Let's change all the letters to the next one in the alphabet, Kayla says. After a little while, Kayla says, I know what the first line says. Me too, Mason says. Have you guys figured out what the first line says? It says, Mason says, dear Mason. Mine says, dear Kayla, Kayla says. They read the rest together. Dear Kayla, come to a street or come to a secret spy party. My house, Saturday at noon. Love, Jillian. Hooray, we cracked the code, Kayla says. Now maybe they can crack my code. I go to the refrigerator. I sit. I say, please get me some cheese. What's the matter, King? Kayla asks. You need to go outside? I groan. I know what he wants, Mason says. He walks over to me. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm going to get some cheese. He picks up my ball. I think King wants to play fetch. Close enough. I love to play fetch. It's my favorite thing. The end. Okay. Well, guys, thank you for joining. Thank you for watching this video. For... All of the questions that I asked, comment below um, in the comment section your answers. And then I think for the letter translation, I'm going to assign it. But there's also going to be a word search, too, that you guys will be doing. Because I went through and read the book ahead of time. And I... Hold on, I'm doing a video. And I went ahead of time. I read the book and I found some sight words and some vocabulary words. So I um, went on the computer, 
I went on a website and I made a word search. So I'm also going to sign that as well. But I do want you guys to translate the letter at the appropriate time in the video. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.